scrap piles are here at the dump and I was checking out the metal bin bunch of good stuff but if you look down here is there uh, moss baskets for flower baskets my mom loves those things so I got a hook here and I'm gonna try and set the camera up maybe you guys can see me digging them out oh, there's a bunch of them so they're kind of tangled up but we'll see what I can get out Oh. 
That looks like all those fancy cages. See, it's kind of hard to tell on the ground here. But definitely some cool steel cages. You can get them loaded up in the truck and head back to the scrap. Yard, junk, yard. Much love, scrap hounds. I got a little break in the rain today. Other than that, big dark cloud. You might be wondering what those are. Those are my couch, inner couch cushion scrap pounds. Out of out, just uh, gonna be giving them a soak in and rinse out these bins. Fill them up with some hot soapy water. Give them a scrubbing. You know, always something fun on Sunday fun day. Now this will make it the first bucket. I'm not sure how many buckets it will take to fill those. This is only like a three gallon, three gallon bucket I think it is. So that'll take me a bit. Number two. Scrap down. Rocky. Rafty. Walking away. That's good. Well, we just get a riff and a rock. Rocky. You going to say hi to the rest of the scrap house? Just the rough bones. Knucklehead. Wait a minute. Hey. What are you doing? Oh, look at this guy. There's a raffy man. Now we just need a riff. I got a riff, raff, and rough. There's number two.
needs more water. Water heavy. Soap didn't last very long. Yeah, not sure what happened. I went to dump that uh, bucket out. Well, that water's black. And anyway, I looked at the camera and the battery is dead. So I was like, oh, not sure where it cut off at. And I got uh, the first rinse out, or well, not rinse out, but scrub down, dunking. And these ones over here were the tops for the pillow top parts for the cushions. They're the worst. Uh, they're going to need a little more scrubbing. It's going to take a little bit more time. But yeah, a little bit of my project here for the day, amongst other things. Excuse me. Yeah, otherwise, just been tinkering around back here, tearing some scrap junk apart. I had a computer there this morning and uh, the printer, and bits and pieces of it. Hard drive out of that printer. I don't know if I showed this. Can't remember now. I got uh, this old cruiser bike. It's not old. I'm going to uh, yeah, pick that up for free. It needs uh, tubes for the tires. And they leak the air out of the tubes as fast as you put it in. Not a big deal. Yes, yes. And that barbecue I drug over here. It's magnetic. It's not actually stainless steel, unfortunately. Oh, Mr. Bones, you yappy guy. Oh, look at this. Porky. Hey, kitty. But yeah. Tear that down, it'll just go into shred. Other than, like, the brass and whatnot from the hoses and the bells. But, uh, yes, yes. Haven't gotten uh, much further along with this stuff here. You gotta get that cleaned out and put over by the shed. It's basically just, uh... There's tubs of uh, aluminum and whatnot into there. Oh, that dog. And uh, stove elements, different things. A couple old shop vacs. Yes, yes. I tore a, a dryer over here, scrapped down. The motor, unfortunately, it was aluminum. So I'm just kind of wishing that I left it. And I get it out of my pile of aluminum. Jeez, jeez. Ay, ay. Add copper wire. I'm gonna try some note, scrap pounds. That cart that was in the box of my truck there. Uh, I'm gonna see if these tires will hold some air. Put them on that uh, cart there and use it to move some stuff around. Reuse. Let's see what the tires say. Check this front one, it's probably different. Yeah, these are actually Kenda tires. Crazy. 40 PSI, alrighty. I think that's on. And it sounds good. Got just a, a pop in thing, they're pretty neat. So you just stick the peg on there, and then they just got a button on the outside. Put the tire there, add that guy, pop in a little hole, make sure it's in there. 
Oh, that didn't work. There we go. I think actually if you push on there, they go in a little easier. Yeah, it's locked in. All right, put the front tire in. This one's got a, uh, most of your mountain bikes or pedal bikes kind of lever. Your quick release. Then just make sure you're in the keepers. Right. Oh, there we go. There, she's a little tight. There we go. Hopefully that's gonna be on there good. Seems to be. Let's go move some junk. Chainsaw. Think she's still pulled? Oh! Now she's junk. Oh, one of my ultimate unfavoritest things toasters. It's got the cord on it. So, you know, it's got top. This thing was never Yeah, pull lamp with the wire. Bam. Gets it closer to the shed. Closer to the shed. Where are you stuck on? You get a hunt. You hunt. That's yeah, a ladder from a tree stand which is aluminum, and it's not going to the scrap pile. So it's a uh, lawn cedar. Push it, and the seed drops down, flings your seed around. I don't need it. Scrap yard needs it, though. Not scrap. This is a decent cage. Oh, it's, uh, I got it upside down. My bad. You just got a little... Hooks here, I got some tie wire, these little rings, so you can set it however far apart you want and uh, hang something, you know, put something across it, boards. It's handy. It's junk, but it's handy. Aluminum snow shovel handle. Put the aluminum pile over there. <laughs> All oh, those golf club sets I got that I love so much. Here's a caddy. It's great though. I would use it to move around things. It's also aluminum. Well, yeah, these guys should have zipped it up and I don't mind going up in here. I if I just sort of set them to the side. Something like that. It doesn't really matter if the cart gets dirty.
recycling. Oh, now I come across it. Darn. Bucket full of coal. <laughs> Using, uh, well, from a coal forge, but that's going to have to be spread out and hopefully dry it out. Dang it. You know, things you forget about. Ay, ay, ay. It don't matter. Good coffee. These actually, old K Plus, they work great. Gardens in the fall, you know, you throw them off. They got the, they keep the frost and the dew off your plants. This cup is all full of different aluminum pieces that I'm going to have to go through. It's full, you know, cook out of, you know, waffle iron things, hot pan tops. You know, all sorts of different breakage. It's heavy, so. A lampshade. <laughs> now we got a new chore to do. Dang it. Good a place as any. Rich. Yeah, it's just from one area to another, but it gets it out of my frontish yard area. Set that light off. Oh, what is this? Oh, boy. Oh. Whew. That don't smell good in there. These kids' toys, though. Unbelievable. Don't want that to break. Microwave dish. Some other stuff. <laughs> Quad. Hey, hey. It's not the first one. It's got the ones up with. Hey, try. Molly old box. Barbecue parts. A dumpster. Oh. Hey, yeah, paint 
hamster's cages turn into great dumpster hooks. I got a few. This one is on a, uh, well, it used a telescope, but it broke. Aluminum scoop shovel, which is really nice, except for the handle broke off. Just right inside here, so I gotta get it out of there, but uh, possibly not scrap yet. The wooden mallet. Blue job. Hasn't been used. Very half rickety snow shovel. Just move it up. Oh yeah, that was on the side of the road. Saw this. Oh yeah. Stuff, more stuff. Is, uh, I don't know, maybe it was in a video. I'm not sure if it ever did. It's pieces of a rim. I think there was an accident on the highway. I was coming along and actually I hit a few of these pieces and they bounced up underneath my truck. I was like, what the heck was that? So I got out, pulled over. And yeah, it's a bunch of the pieces of the aluminum rim. A clothesline? Of that rim. More of that uh, mud flaps. Pull the big screws and stuff out of it. Here's a hoe. Nice little pail. But it's got a crack in it, but that's okay. Crack pails still get love around here. Random joke. A little mini dumpster hook. Good bunch of stuff for Thursday's dump run though. Love it, love it. What's this? Oh, from the damn pole lamp. Oh, this I'll have to get. Oh, even that aluminum scoop shovel. I'm just kidding. Shred. Metal. I don't know what it is. Cart or tub? Cart or tub? Mm. Move the dumpster hook. It's a cart full of scrap. I need a drink. Make the planet great again, scrap hounds. Life's good. Recycling one piece of scrap at a time. But yeah. I can grab the rake. That's most of the stuff will be getting loaded up for Thursday's dump run. Good stuff, good stuff. 
But yeah, that gets that uh, corner cleaned up. And there's a fire pit grill or grate in there. There's still a few things I got to get to and it'll clean this, uh, these rose bushes and the shrubs and stuff up. But yeah, that looks much better, much better. Sunday fun day scrap hounds. We're finishing this up, didn't I uh, start over there? This was last Sunday, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below. And that echo chainsaw. Yeah, it's, uh, pick that up. I think the whole exhaust is taken off. You can see right into the cylinder. But yeah. I put that aluminum there for now. That saw will just set him here on the table. On that table. Well, it's like a table, but it's pallets soon. My. <laughs> <He's>. <laughs> oh, good stuff, good stuff. Love it, I love it. Keep positive, keep going, keep scrapping. Heck yeah, heck yeah. And the great part is, is now most of all of my junk, except for the aluminum that's way over there and the stuff that's out by the garage, is all out by the scrap shack. So, now I have to look at it every time I'm out here working. Probably gonna have a fire this evening, I would imagine. Be a nice evening. Hopefully no rain in the forecast. You never know, it can go from sunny and beautiful. Well, it's a little overcast, but five minutes later it'll be pouring rain and a thunderstorm. Possible tornado warnings. No, we don't have that. I'm just, you know, that's the weather in Alberta. If you don't like it, wait five minutes. <laughs> And I guess before I forget and I leave things still sitting over here, I do gotta take this stuff yet. The barbecue will stay here. I'll probably just scrap that here and get a little full of room over there. But it's definitely getting better, getting better. I say that all the time, don't I? Drink. Thirty-one point four degrees. Yeah, she got much hotter than it was earlier. Well, scrap pounds. I'm gonna love you and I'm gonna leave you. We're gonna wrap it up here. If you liked the video, smash the like button. Drop me a comment or two down below. If you're new to the channel and you enjoyed the video, want to see more? Hit the subscribe button. And if you really want to see more, Jingle that bell for the notifications when I upload more videos, shorts. I got a mosquito here. He wants to say hello. <laughs> anyway, cheers, scrap pounds. Much love, much love. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'm going to go and have a fire. Sunday, fun day, hot dog. Check out those hot dog sticks. Ready. <laughs> You're acting crazy. Scratching your back. <laughs> Did a good scratch. <laughs> hey, crazy dog. <laughs>